stuff. Let's see the dead. Oh my god. Yeah, it definitely sees me. Okay, she's summoning a lot more bees. This should be into rare. It's way better than the wall. Hey, everyone, welcome back to another Minecraft slash Terraria video. But we are here today. We're trying to find Minecraft mods that add in Terraria bosses or as close as they can to Terraria bosses. Because obviously things are not going to be perfect, a one to one match. But we're going to try our best here. We're doing the pre hard mode bosses because I think doing all how many bosses in there in the game, like 18, something like that, not including mini bosses event bosses and so there's a lot of bosses in the game but let's get to it now for king slime it's like gamers why don't you just play terraria craft now nah, that's that's literally a perfect example of a terraria boss literally in minecraft so i decided you know let's not do that one let's make it a little bit harder boom not really that much harder there's literally a mod called terrarian slimes i'm playing the fabric version of minecraft which if you guys don't know fabric is like another mod loader like forge and if you guys don't know what forge is it's like team mod loader for terraria but yes as you can see there's a bunch of slimes here maybe i check out this mod on its own later but we are here for one thing and one thing only and that is the king slime which one looks like a king which egg looks like a king none of them apparently i guess none of them all right aha slime crown summons king slime let's see it oh my god hold it is there music let me turn on the music i don't think there's music it's all good I'll, I'll put my own music right here you know terraria boss one music but look at this he grows the size oh my god that's amazing i like that honestly that's more theatric than terraria now i'm not seeing a ninja inside of him that's all good but let's hop in a uh, game mode at zero here or survival you know i'm still a minecraft og i still see all the numbers and stuff but let's see the dead oh my god i know i'm not wearing armor but that was a chunky hit he just hit me with right there all right hopping back into creative i don't want to deal with this it's so how fast is he okay he's not that fast wait does he teleport <gasps> i guess that answers that question all right let's go ahead let's kill him let me whip out a netherite sword here and let me just beat his ass see what he drops so he's got the little spike slimes that come out i do want to actually see the attacks from them let's see the attacks from the spike slimes okay it's just like terraria beautiful let's kill these dudes get them out of here maybe let's fight them straight up let's see, let's see what happens doesn't seem too bad of a fight i mean it is the king slime it's not really that hard of a fight in regular terraria too but honestly maybe it is a little bit harder in minecraft you get less projectile weapon choices you just get a bow a crossbow if you get lefty you know you get a trident but like it's the king slime i don't think you'd be saving all the goods to fight the king slime because you know the king slimes it's the first boss pretty much the first boss in terraria hold up can i cheese him like this hold up he's cheesable hey this isn't a oh I, I take it back i take it back so the only thing that i think i'm noticing here is he doesn't actually shrink in size the more or the less health he has it's all good like i said it's not going to be perfect match to terraria but there you go dead and what does he drop in this mod king slime ball what, what does this do can i eat it what can i do with it can i put it on i don't know maybe it's just like a trophy all right let's move on to the next mod okay we are here in a 1.16.5 forge world this time not a 1.16.5 fabric world and uh we're gonna be skipping the eye of cthulhu but i do have some uh, fillers we could put for the eye of cthulhu now maybe like gamers why not just use that eye of cthulhu mod you used or you checked out in a video back in the day i'm trying to keep it to current minecraft as much as i love you know 1.7.10 1.12.2 modded minecraft 1.16.5 modded minecraft is insanely good it's nothing but like quality content from 1.16.5 i'm talking about you can be pages deep on the mod list or mod browser whatever you want to call it and there will still just be quality content and also i'm pretty sure that mod that had the eye cthulhu is older than 1.7.10 i think it was like 1.6 1.5 oh look at that there's a boss health bar on my screen you like to see that so that's the reason why we're not using that mod but yeah this is the best i could do here uh it's just like a gas boss now i was thinking about the your gas from the twilight forest mod very popular minecraft mod if you don't know it but like literally this is the best thing i could find man it's just like a gas it looks like the eye of cthulhu it's got the same shape if you think about it minus all the you know extra heads and stuff put a eye cthulhu texture pack on it boom we've seen the eye cthulhu texture pack on gas before so it's not like it's something new but there you go that's the best we could get and this is from the stalwart dungeons mod 
Boom, bada, bing. On to the next. We have the Eater of Worlds next. For this boss, I'm going to head to the end. Or I'm going to try and go. Actually, we don't need to go to the end. Let me just go really far. I do believe you fight this boss in the end when you play the actual mod. All right, hopefully this is far enough away. What the heck is going on over there? Uh, you know, let's go this way. Let's go into the mountains for this. But we go to one of my favorite mods. This is probably currently my favorite mod of Minecraft right now is Alex's Mobs. It's such a good mod, dude. It adds in a bunch of like regular animals. And then it also adds in a bunch of cool ones. Let me whip open the dictionary here. And as you can see, there's so many. There's so many. I love this mod. Look, Bone Serpent. This looks familiar, huh? You like Among Us? Well, guess what? There's literally Among Us. You like Tornadoes? There you go. That's an interesting thing to like. But yeah let's check out what we're looking for here boom the void worm this will be our eater of worlds and you may be like huh how game writers how did they put something that's like the eater of worlds in minecraft well let's check it out let's check it out when i saw this thing dude my jaw dropped let me turn down the volume just in case it's a little loud boom beautiful so not only is it a giant segmented worm that makes really loud noises this thing starts teleporting and stuff and i'm kind of scared to like hop out of creative to see it teleport because like i don't want to die oh there it goes teleporting maybe i don't have to hop out of creative okay maybe i will still will just to take a couple hits but i'm pretty sure we could go through these teleporters or these portals too yeah look at that that's so cool all right let's see if it attacks me do you see me i hope it sees me what is that oh yeah it definitely sees me uh i guess these can be considered like the spit it does in expert mode or if you really want to not even think of it as the eater the destroyer and it could be like the probes i guess but still very cool very unique i love to see a boss like this in minecraft oh my god it does a lot of damage on to the next one i'm out of here all right i don't have anything for the brain of cthulhu the brain of cthulhu that's a hard one to find it's very very specific so that one we will not be doing sadly we're moving on to the next the next best thing and look at that this shows us our next best thing right here is that a beehive hmm i wonder what we're checking out next yes sir we're checking out the queen bee this is from the astamir's forest mod i believe that's how you pronounce it something like that and i really like the astamir's forest mod it's a really cool mod and once i saw that it added the queen bee you know it made a terraria guy like me fall in love with it let's check it out oh my god that is a scary effect she like shakes your screen all right obviously i gotta hop into survival here hopefully i don't get my ass beat too badly where'd she go she's running come back here she's sending out evil bees what is this soul what the hell what's up so what you trying to do i want to see her like full-on attacks she might not do like the dashes uh the, the queen bee does in terraria obviously like i said things are not going to be exactly the same look at that she sends out little bees just like the terraria version does it seems like she doesn't do much wait other than scream god damn let's chill with the screaming though Maybe I gotta damage her to see like a phase two or something. Okay, she summoned in a lot more bees. This is very fun. <laughs> but I can barely hit these things. These things are so fast. And it's like every time she screams, they attack. That's pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna kill her now. Ew, she busted honey on me. All right, there you go she's dead very cool boss a very cool boss a uh, very annoying noise but what bosses do not make annoying noises it seems like that's a trend with a lot of bosses in video games but look at this she drops a stinger look at that you can pretty much make a beekeeper sword royal staff i think i know exactly what that royal staff does minecraft summoner only let's see let's see watch you do something completely different now nah, it has to summon a bees there's no way yes sir yes sir hornet staff question mark all right so next up is skeletron you may be like skeletron that's not too hard to find wrong could not find anything for skeletron the closest thing i found was like mods that added in like wither type bosses that kind of look like just like a floating skull but pretty much let's just consider the wither from a vanilla minecraft a uh a type of skeletron boss i guess boom bada bing look at that yeah close enough to skeleton just pretend that those are hands or something i don't know all right so moving on we will kind of do a mini boss here before i show what i could find for the wall of flesh the dark mage we're not doing lepus we're not doing turkor i feel like lepus maybe would have been findable if i looked really really deep but i was already like 20 something pages in it, it was getting kind of hard to find stuff but yeah the dark mage is pretty much just a lich it literally is just like a mage that spawns in a bunch of skeletons in enemies and stuff so 
what better thing to find than literally the lich from minecraft dungeons i love minecraft dungeons it's like one of my favorite type of uh dungeon delving games like that another one that i like is diablo and uh, as you can see i installed a mod in here that pretty much adds in like everything from minecraft dungeons this is dope as hell uh but yeah we want to check out the mobs from it obviously i think i'm literally gonna type in lich and it should come up question mark i hope i don't remember if it actually was called a lich in the game or not here you go it's either the nameless or it's the necromancer let me see boom necromancer is he all right nameless it's the nameless but i don't <laughs> that scared the hell out of me i don't know why we have to punch him a bunch of times is that does the same happen for this guy yeah i guess so but look at that he spawns in a bunch of enemies a bunch of well they're pretty much supposed to be skeletons i don't know why there's a husk hey you know what else spawns in skeletons the dark mage so this is gonna be our closest to the dark mage there's a lot of mods that add in liches and stuff so this one was not too hard to find last but not least this one is pretty funny obviously finding a direct wall of flesh that's damn near impossible i don't know maybe you guys know some mods that's the thing you guys are gonna be able to type in the comments tell me some like underrated mods that you guys might know that add in bosses like this terraria bosses in minecraft but if i type in flesh here we don't get the wall of flesh instead we get the wheel of flesh <laughs> i know the next best thing let's see it in action here oh yeah the wheel of flesh this should be in terraria is way better than the wall let's see how much health he has hopefully not too much can i actually hit him where's his hitbox at oh my god he has a lot of health i need a stronger sword what's the strongest sword we can get here this one does 15 this is still gonna take a while okay i do want to see how it attacks me let me eat this thing and then let me kill this i don't know what the hell this thing is but let me kill it and then let's hop out of survival or out of creative here let's see how it attacks don't one tap me please oh damn yeah he's rolling at us this is kind of scarier than the wall okay he doesn't do that much damage it's fine here you go i found something that does a thousand and one attack damage can minecraft bosses survive the god sword new series absolutely not he, that one did not survive all right what did it drop i'm assuming flesh flesh would make sense if it dropped that oh look at that we can make some flesh items a key capable of unlocking a corrupt altar hold up terraria reference <laughs> But yeah, that will be all for today's video. Fun little video. I've had this idea for a while. And I honestly, I was thinking about making like a mod pack with like a bunch of Terraria bosses in Minecraft form, something like that, obviously not going to be directly Terraria bosses again, but like something like that, making a mod pack and trying to beat all of them up to like whatever boss is the last one the wheel of flesh i guess if we want to fight the wheel of flesh but yeah you guys let me know on that idea again leave some comments if you know some uh some mods that add in some bosses keep it to like current day minecraft because you know there has been attempts in the past to add in terraria bosses to minecraft but some of them are like really really old now but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to check out all these mods shout out all the developers and stuff and one last thing i wanted to see this guy this is like my favorite boss in minecraft dungeons oh my god look at how sexy he is let's fight him survival mode take fight me oh he does weak ass damn get him out of here I'm about, to, I'm about to die from the cubes that he drops. Look at that. He gave me some head. <laughs>